June twentieth, Saint Silverius, Pope and Martyr. He was born in the year 480 in Italy to future Pope Saint Hormostas before Hormostas had entered the priesthood. Silverius was a subdeacon when the Ostrogothic king Theodahad nominated him to the papacy. He was consecrated on June 8th in the year 536 as successor to Saint Agapetus, who had angered Theodora by condemning the patriarch Anthemus of Constantinople and thus ruining her plans to restore monophysitism which was a doctrine that christ only has one nature rather than two human and divine when silverius refused to restore anthemus theodora ordered the byzantine general belisarius to enter rome and dispose silverius she had him replaced with the deacon vigilius then nuncio to constantinople the ostrogothic king then surrounded rome and besieged belisarius who in March 537 falsely accused Silverius of treasonable collaboration with the Goths. Silverius was degraded to the rank of monk and driven from his see to Lycia. He appealed to Theodoro's husband, the emperor Justinian I, who, apparently unaware of the situation, sent Silverius back to Rome for an inquiry. Vigilius was able to banish his rival by force and was consecrated bishop of Rome in his stead. Silverius was taken to the island of Palmyra and kept there in close confinement. Here he died in consequence of the privations and harsh treatment he endured. The year of his death is unknown, but it's usually given as 537, as most people believe he did not live long after reaching Palmyra. He was buried there on the island on June 20th, his remains were never taken from Palmyra. In later times, he was venerated as a saint. The earliest proof of this is given by a list of saints in the 11th century, and also one in the 14th century contains his feast, which is recorded in the present Roman martyrology on the 20th of June.